Yep, I'm watching myself on my own computer. Why? Because I finally recorded my third anniversary happy birthday shoutouts video, which I promised I was going to do, and I had to do it, and it's going to be a week late, but at least I did it. Anyways, hello everyone, welcome to March. I don't know, no, no, it's March, it's April. First, hello everyone, welcome to April 1st, Tuesday, April 1st, 2014. I'm Exceeding Shadow, and today, or, and Shadow is correct, and today is April Fool's Day. Um, me personally, I don't do April Fool's Day. I think the very last thing I did in April Fool's was like, maybe junior high. I don't remember it, but it's probably junior high. But for a fact, what I remembered was in elementary. I'm not the person I like to fool around on April Fool's Day, even though I, I'm a goofy, weird guy, a lot of people tell me. But I don't fool with people because it would probably hurt their feelings or everyone knows it's April Fool's Day and it's just so hard to fool anyone. So I don't take, I don't try to fool anyone at all. On online, it's it's easy to fool people, so I don't do that because they're too gullible. Only things that you wish was actually real, they uh, will most likely not be actually real. So that's kind of my thing. And my, my voice is actually kind of tired because I recorded an hour about anniversary, third anniversary, happy birthday, shoutouts video. <laughs> Anyways, um, I just want to say. That today was kind of a weird day. Um, I didn't mention it yesterday, but I wanted to. Uh, today I had to go in early because uh, we're doing t uh, training for some company. I don't know, a new product. We had to go in at 12 p.m. noon. Then we got out at uh, 8. So uh, all this time I was recording that and I was watching a couple videos. But what I wanted to do the most was actually play a game on PS3. But it's almost that time actually to start getting off eventually. But, hey, uh, it was something I really wanted to do. And I think I wanted to do it now because if I didn't do it now, I don't think I had time. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of it. Now, um, was there anything new? Maybe. Um, I think... I think I told you I played a little bit of each five games I got yesterday. If I didn't, uh, I should. Yeah, I think I did. So, yeah, that's, that's it. So, now you probably want to know something that's probably catching my mind. Google, which is ended today, which you guys won't see until like the 4th. No. Yeah, you probably guys won't see this video until the 4th of April. So, that's kind of a shame. Um, Pokemon was on Google Maps. I knew about it for a day ago, or two, maybe. But I didn't, I wasn't that, like, okay, whatever. And then when I actually saw something about it, I was like, wow. So, Pokemon was on Google Maps. Apparently, if you can catch every single Pokemon, all the specific ones on Google Maps, and you caught them all, I guess you would be really, really cool or something. I don't know. Um, I never actually heard anyone actually try doing it yet. But... Of course, it was probably April Fool's joke because it ended. To, it supposed to end today, April Fool's. I think that's what I, that's what I heard. But it might be an April Fool's joke itself. Or what I heard that it ends, or actually it's the whole thing itself. I don't know. Anyways, um, yeah, that's probably that's really cool. I saw it. It's actually really interesting. It's like a guy trying to catch right you. It's like cool. So, um, anyways, <coughs> Ooh, sorry. Uh, today. I was thinking, mostly yesterday, but I didn't talk about it. Maybe I did. Yeah, I did, but not a little bit. I was thinking about the freaking Uncharted bundle. Uh, the bundle, I, I didn't show it to you guys on the paper. So I got a paper from GameStop, but I didn't show the bundle. This bundle right here. Let's see if I could just autofocus. There you go. Uncharted Drake's Fortune, Uncharted 2, among... Uh, Something among these, yeah, among these and Uncharted Three, Drake's Deception. Uh, it would have been fifteen dollars, if not fourteen, and I wanted to buy all three, but the GameStop doesn't have it. I was so sad. Uh, so I was thinking to myself, the other games I saw on the PS3 I've been wanting, and I looked at my uh, paper and I had a couple more last night, and I was trying to think to myself, okay, 
Now I have a good glimpse of how much some of these games were at GameStop. How much can I find out for other places like pawn shops and swap meets and really retro stores or anything else? So I started thinking, uh, how much was Sly Cooper for these in time in stores? Apparently it's 18 or $20 new or used. I was like, okay. And then when I saw it at the swap meet about two weeks ago, which I think it's still there, I think, they were asking only 15 and, I was, and I'm thinking now, that's a good deal. Good deal. Not too much of a good deal. Something like a couple of dollars off, like three or three. Two or three. It's like three or four, but but uh, depending on if they want to go lower. It's just, uh, you, you know, bar bargaining. But, uh, you know, that was a good deal. And I want to go back just for that. Uh, yes, I also wanted to see if it was actually on the PS3 games. Because, remember, I don't pay attention to PS3 games because I just got a PS3. But now, I can because, like I said, I don't have any information on how much games are for the PS3. And that's a good idea why I actually went to the GameStop and checked out the whole section to see a good amount of money I have to be spending on some of these games I'm actually looking for. Like, for basically all God of, God of War, it's kind of expensive. The Ratchet and Clank's are all kind of cheap, actually. Uh, Kingdom Hearts is, like, freaking hard to find for some reason. <laughs> it shouldn't be. But but they told me they just sell out a lot on that, so, hey, it's okay. Kingdom Hearts, uh, and Famous, it's not expensive, it's just, uh, I just can't find a hard cop, what hard cop, I just can't find the, uh, artwork for it, which is weird, really weird, uh, there's just a bunch of other games that is, like, 30, like, $30, is, uh, third-party games, but I'm just not sure if I want it for that console, or do I want it for the 360, because, well, uh, let's take a look at my 360 games again, huh? They're mostly all third parties. Other than that, they're uh, first parties. Yeah, so we got Assassin's Creed, Oscar's Wrath, Batman Arkham City and Or. Oh, no, not City and Or. Asylum and or uh, City, Bayonetta, Blazer Continuous Shift. The ones I just seen right there were all uh, third parties. Then Blue Dragon's uh, uh, exclusive. And then Borderlands 1, 2, Bulletstorm is third parties. Death Smiles, exclusive. Devil May Cry, HD Collection, Devil May Cry 4, Bruce Limit, Dragon Ball Z, where is all third parties. And then Dreamcast Collection, first party. Gears of War 1, 2, and 3, and Judgment, first parties. Halo, th well, 3, ODST, 3, 4, Reach, Anniversary, Halo Wars, first parties. Uh, Left 4 Dead 1 and 2, first parties. Lollipop Chainsaw. Ultimate Marvel's Capcom 3, the original Marvel's Capcom 3, Naruto Storm 2, Generations, Persona 4, Arena, Portal 2, Prototype 2, Resident Evil 5, 6, Sonic 06, Generations, uh, the original uh, All-Stars Racing, uh, Ultimate Genesis Collection, Unleashed, Friend of Foe, Web of Shadows, Star Wars Force Unleashed, Tomb Raider, and Transformers Fall of Cybertron, are all third parties. As you can tell, I have a lot more third parties than I have first parties. So I'm thinking that my 360 is a third party console for me. That's kind of what it shows. So that's why I want my PS3 to be exclusives to games. So that's why I bought all the games that were, except for the HD collection of Eco and Shut the Closet. I just personally thought it was a good deal because I was looking for both, anyways. <laughs> uh, so, I'm looking for exclusives. I know a good couple of exclusives, because I already named some, but I'm looking for the one side that's pretty hard to find, and I know I actually want or like, but you never know. Anyways, I'm still been thinking about that, that uh, Sly Cooper for at the Swamp Meet. It's $15. It's calling my name. It's hopefully it's still there if I go Sunday or Saturday, because they're there both days. But I... That's just a theory. A sly theory. Hopefully it's still there. <laughs> um, anyways, that's kind of what I wanted to talk about today. Because today was just kind of weird. Dull. Okay, boring. Away. So, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Anyways, thank you all for watching. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Because uh, tomorrow, for some reason, I'm actually going back to my original weird time. one thirty to 10 which was my actual preferred time when I was working there at the time, at the, uh, for the very first week, for 
production 130 to 10 tomorrow only again tomorrow only <laughs> so thank you for watching see you guys tomorrow and don't forget to like if you subscribe below and uh, hopefully i got that slide cooper for these in time on sunday or saturday i have five days maybe four <sighs> you gotta wait see you guys that day or and tomorrow bye